Here's a little drama to be played out on a very small stage. It's a familiar story to all of us. In fact, it may resonate with you more than you might imagine. The players in this little drama will be represented by little wooden discs. We've made each one of these very special and very important. This one, we call life. It represents that span of years we have on this earth. The time that we live and love and learn and do the best we can to make this world a better place before we leave it. The other disc is the opposite end. Death. The end of that cycle. The stopping of those years and that span. It's over here on the far end of that story. There's one other player that can enter in. And it's this little guy. This is despair. <laughs> He's not a happy camper. That is quite a frown you have there. Despair are those great, great feelings of loneliness and, and suffering and, and, uh, and alienation and being misunderstood and being hopeless. And somehow when despair enters in, can cause you to think that it might be best for everyone if you move that span between life and death closer together. In fact, if despair enters into that normal operation of life and death, it can cause you to contemplate ending that cycle or committing suicide, taking your own life. We just want to say it's a very common thing, it's a story everyone's familiar with. But no matter how lonely you are, or how desperate you are, or how misunderstood you feel, please know there is always help. If you'll stop, reach out for some help, talk to a friend, talk to anyone, find a little understanding and a little help, you'd be amazed that if you take a deep breath, that despair can be gone. While it may not ever be completely gone, it can be contained. Once it is contained, it can be kept in a proper perspective. Perhaps there are things in your life that need attention or change. You cannot make those changes if you're not here to live them. You're thinking about ending your life. You're having a hard time staying on the planet. Please, please reach out. And if you know someone who's suffering, Please reach out to them. Thank you.